quarantine and I found a recipe for pizza buns and I'm gonna try them out and show you how to make them. First thing you're gonna to wanna to do is to preheat your oven to 375 degrees. So what you're gonna need for this is one cup of flour, one cup of shredded mozzarella cheese, one cup of sliced pepperoni, one cup of whole milk, one egg, and one teaspoon of baking powder. Side note, you're gonna want some pizza sauce to dip later because the actual bites don't have any sauce in them. Now what you're gonna do is you're gonna take all of your mixed ingredients, you're gonna take a roller spatula and mix it together until it's all blended. Now, I've never made these before, so I have no idea how they're gonna turn out. Honestly, I think they might be pretty bad, but I'll have to wait and see. So, I mixed up my batter, um, so it's all well blended. And now, we need to pour it into the muffin tins. I'm gonna take a muffin tin, spray it down. Take another muffin tin, it down because so I'm pretty sure it's going to need two. I'm going to attempt to pour this into the little uh, crap. to put it in but now it got kind of sloppy so I'm just gonna put them in the oven okay so my oven's done I'm just gonna put those in there close it up Alexa set a timer for 12 minutes so basically all you're gonna do you're gonna leave it in there for 12 minutes on 375 degrees and then after that 12 minutes check it with a toothpick stick it in um, if it comes out with batter on it, it's not ready, leave it in there for another like two minutes. And then, um, but if it comes out clean, you know they're ready to eat. And they're starting to overflow a little bit. I'm hoping that that's all they're gonna expand. But, I mean, I don't know. So I think next time, I should fill them a little less. Okay, so, time went off. They do not really look ready to me. Um, I don't know though, so I'm going to take them out and then we'll see how they do with the toothpick test. Just gonna put it in there. Mm, I'll try that one. Yeah, there's still a bit of batter, so I'm going to put them in for another minute. Oh, Alexa, set a timer for one minute. Probably still not ready. God damn it. Alexa, set a timer for two minutes. Two minutes. Starting now. Oh, it was earlier today. It, it was it was Okay, yeah. so basically it's, I don't know if I get them I, out. Well, I mean, today was just but I'm gonna try years. just um, cutting around.
Okay, so first impression, they're good. They're not bad. I was expecting them to be a little bit bad, but um, no, I actually kind of like them. They're a little bit bland, and um, you definitely need to dip them in the, so in the sauce, I think. I think the pepperoni, if you don't have the pepperoni in there, it, it it's just kind of like a weird cheese muffin. No, yeah, um, don't make this without the pepperoni. Snack sauce would probably be better for this. It's good though, like I want to eat more of them. Maybe that's just because I'm hungry. So there wasn't actually that much cleanup for this. There wasn't that much materials with them. As you can see, there's a lot of them here. Really all I had to clean was the mixing bowl and these things. And I didn't spill that much. A lot of the ingredients were pretty common. You would have in your home. I might make this a series, I don't know. Um, so I did discover as I was eating these that it's a lot better with warm sauce as opposed to like cold sauce straight from your fridge. Thanks for watching. Um, I hope you enjoyed, and maybe you'll make it. I don't know.